y'all, it's Taryn. Welcome back to my channel and welcome to a Walmart haul. We've done a lot of Walmart hauls here over the years and typically I shop via the app, online versus in store. I just find they have a lot more options. However, in those videos, I'll get at least one comment that says, oh, I wish my store had what your store has, but that's not from my store. I shopped online. So I thought that it would be fun to go in store and see if they actually have anything worth you taking the time out of your day to go inside. So that's what we're doing. I have already shopped in store, by the way. So let me throw in some footage of that. And then we'll come back here and chat about some pieces. You'll see it in the video. Some things may not work, some things may be home run. So let's go shopping. We're shopping at what we call the big Walmart. Do y'all call it big Walmart, small Walmart? They have a ton. This is like the big, it used to be, what did they call it? Super Walmart, super center, super store. Um, so we have several in town, but this one is the big one nearest to me and has the most clothing options. I see plus size over there. I see Tara and Sky Plus. However, sometimes we have good luck in the straight size section. So let's shop a little bit there first. Like this is kind of cute. Oh, it's very soft. No boundaries is the brand. Also comes in tan. Could be cute with a turtle, like mock neck turtleneck underneath. I think we're going with tan, extra, extra large. 19 is the size, it's juniors, like plus sizing. That's the largest one I can find, but okay we'll start with this i have seen these sweatpants all over the place like every boutique is selling them i think they're the zanana brand from boutiques but here there are no boundaries but these like acid wash jogger sweatpants i could always use a pair and i see an extra 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 large or a 21. they're very soft this could be cute under our vest this mock neck sleeveless which is kind of more what I need anyways, because where I live, we know it's not super chilly. All right, I was gonna pull the brown, but I see a green over there. How do we feel about the green? I think that's the one. We need some flare ribbed leggings for $7.98, because those could be cute too. Are these black? Yes. Oh, you're, okay, there we go. I thought they were maybe navy. I kept a pair recently from Aerie and I don't know if I love them. So we might could test these out for $7.98. You can't beat it. No joke, I just bought a pair of these almost exactly like this from Target. And the size, like the fit is a little bit off, but I love the green cargo style. They had the elastic in the back as well. How much are these? $17.98. I wanna say they were probably 25, 30 bucks at Target. So let's see if we can actually do a Junior's Plus size and bottoms. Extra, extra large or a 19 is the largest size I see, but I feel like it's worth a shot. Also that, are we just finding stuff? What if none of it works? Oh my gosh, that is so cute. Like a moto biker, it looks a little bit cropped, faux leather jacket. I could always use one of those. I just tried this on and it doesn't fit. Am I making a mistake getting the pants in the same size? I don't know. Okay, let's go over to actual plus size and see if we can complete some outfits. Does this not look like that pullover I kept from Aerie too? I kept it in a green color, this color, and mine was a like snap instead of button, but that looks like it as well. For $17.98, yeah, I feel like we could get some airy dupes here it is in this color that's a beautiful color i did just do like a big clean out and i don't need things like this i need to tell i need to remember to tell myself that waffle knit dresses this color is not my favorite but those are cute with little booties let's see they have black and oh that's a different style no buttons just like a flat dress what is this this feels like a cardigan it is Okay, I wish they had the black in this style. They have a kind of sort of like a vest, but in plus version. I kind of like this one a little bit better, but this one I feel like you need, you definitely need a long sleeve shirt underneath it. Or can we just get the green mock neck sleeveless that we already have? Oh, it comes in a bunch of colors. Orange, gray, black. Please tell me these are in plus size. An entire two racks of Sophia jeans. 
I think these are my favorite ones that I always talk about. I mine are in a size 20. It looks like they only go up to a size 18. These are my favorite jeans ever, y'all. Ever. Do we get them? No, because they're not even the right size. Okay, let's look and see if they have any. Here's a size 20. And it doesn't really tell me the style. But for 22 bucks. Okay, they're like a little bit of a cropped, skinny ankle. Those are so cute, that style. I'm debating between these two burnt orange pullovers. This one I love more, but it's from the straight sizes. Extra, extra large is the largest size I can find, but I love that it buttons. I love the ribbed. It has a hoodie. Like that one is just different than anything that you normally see because this is kind of what you normally see, the hoodie style. But I like the bit of like sweater material, it's got a hoodie. This is also from the straight size, but it's one size bigger. So I don't know. I think that we should probably go with the one that I really want. They're both the same price, by the way. They also have these in men's, but jogger version. Do we like these better? I have no idea what size I wear in men's. 2XL. These are kind of cute. I think right now they have this style too, but they're not elastic in the waist. I think right now what's a little bit more popular is the straight or wider leg versus the jogger, but I do like those. I also see them in this, I see one pair anyways, in this like white windbreaker material. Before I do a final decision on outfits that we're getting, let's go look at shoes because I have a pair of boots from here a tan slouchy boot that are incredible and I want to see if I can find something just as great all right boots let's start here first I have several pairs at home that I like oh my gosh there they are y'all the ones I was just telling you about these like slouchy I've had them for a couple of years and they go with so many outfits I wear a size 10 I'm normally a nine nine and a half I grab these in a 10 and they fit so nice. I will link them for you. So I'm only grabbing boots or some sort of shoe if I see something that I don't have at home. I wish they had these in store. And they also come in a tan, like a very tan color and black. If they had either of those in store, I would buy them. Remember, I hauled these in my last Walmart video, but I have the ones with the leopard print on the back. And they're so cute. Birkenstock dupes. I did order me some from their actual Birkenstocks, but they're a gray corduroy. But these are really cute too. I think these are really fun in the fall. They're really easy to style with pretty much anything. How much are they? 20 bucks. Do I grab a cheap like option to see how we like them? The no boundaries version of my favorite white chunky sneakers. The ones I have, I think are time and true, but they look, I mean, identical to this. These are so fun. Avia is the is the brand memory foam 23 bucks that's pretty I think these are little kids shoes now <laughs> they look a little bit small yeah okay so we're in the kids shoes I'm headed to check out and I stopped because I love this dress could be very nice for like fall weddings if you're a guest but it's got these cutouts here just in the front not in the back I like this color but also this blue this is the one I almost put in my cart but I'm, I'm passing. Let me know if you want me to come back and try it, and I will. I just don't know how many people would like that if it's cooler outside to have those cutouts. Let's talk about this top first. Obviously, I showed you two different options, and I went with this one. I just felt like this one was a little bit different than the typical, like, pullover that you see, and it's not a super thick material as if it were a jacket. It's just a really pretty, like, burnt orange actual hoodie pullover that does button. I do wish that I could find this in one size up. I just think I would like it a little bit more roomy, but I liked the curved hem. It's not terrible. You know what I mean? I'm just looking in this mirror right here. Um, I'll probably end up keeping it because it is a super soft, lighter weight material and the color is just very fall. All right, these leggings, $7.98. They're ribbed flare, like high-waisted. They're a little bit short, I will say. Do we do it anyways? They could be really nice, like lounge type pants, but the fit is incredible. Let me know, do we keep the bottoms? 
and the top. Let me know. Do we keep both pieces? I did grab the Birkenstock dupes. I got them in my like true size nine. Time and True is the brand. Now I mentioned in that video that I ordered an actual pair of Birkenstocks in a gray corduroy but these were 20 bucks, less than 20 bucks, technically at $19.98. So I think I might keep them. They're very comfortable. They're cute. I think they could be really fun styled. The This outfit, I think the pants are too short for the shoes. So I'll show you what it looks like here. Because again, the pants are just a tad bit short, but these are a steal. Would it be a tearing video without a graphic tee? Though I will say, I've kind of gotten out of showing too many graphic t-shirts. But this one, David Bowie, I think it was $19, $10, $9.98. I love the gray color. Okay, these joggers, I have seen probably every single boutique that pops up on my TikTok that sells plus size. They have these acid wash like lounge joggers. They're always sold out of my size, but also they're like 30 bucks is the cheapest that I've seen them. These were $14.98. No Boundaries is the brand. I got them in a size extra 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 large which is a 21 in juniors plus they're soft they're long enough i love the acid wash look with the tee it's just tucked in in the front this could be a really nice like very easy like casual look here's what the t-shirt looks like untucked i did grab the t-shirt i'm pretty sure in the largest size available yes which is a 22 because it's technically from the straight size time and true, so it's extra, extra, extra large. Um, so it's meant to be a little bit more of a fitted tee, but we know I don't love like super fitted things. So I'll always size up and then it just fits me like it's not roomy or anything, but I liked the gray on gray. I feel like I need to keep both of these pieces. I would most likely style these with white sneakers and then you've just got a warmer weather fall look, which is exactly what I'm looking for. Let's try these next. I, I don't know if these are gonna work. I measured the waist, like held them up next to the black pants that I bought and they were the same like length. However, that jacket I tried on was way too small. Unfortunately, they will not button. I mean, I could probably get them buttoned, but there's no sense because they're too snug. But the length is nice. Like this look is really pretty. So I mentioned in the shopping video that I ended up grabbing some from Target. So let me put those on instead. Target ones win. They were 35 bucks. The Walmart ones I think were $17.98. I don't remember exactly. These just fit better. They fit period. <laughs> um, they're in a size 1X. The 2X, like I would like them a little bit looser in the stomach area, but the 2X was just a little bit too baggy. Same graphic tee. We will change it after this look. Let's do these Sophia jeans. These are the Melissa Flair. So I have the Melissa pull-on Flair, which are the ones that I love, but these have a button zip. The ones I showed in my last Walmart video were Marisol, I think, and they were more of like a boot cut. Um, unfortunately, these aren't gonna work. I think these are a size 20 straight size versus a size 20 plus size. Those are two different things. Let's just pretend if they did work, we'll just tuck this in and let me show you the outfit. Black and white plaid, Tara and Sky in a size 2X. They had quite a few plaid like variations. I don't remember if I showed you all of them or not, but I thought that this would be cute kind of left open with the graphic tee and the black flares and some like heeled black boots. My plan was to tuck the shirt in, but we can't do that now. I might end up keeping the graphic tee and this because again, I have different black boot cut or flare jeans that could work just as well. So this whole look is very cute. I'm just disappointed in the bottoms. I probably need to size up two sizes to get them to fit how I want, but I don't know if they go that large. Like what I need to do is try to find these in a tall version in plus size. Pulling out my own jeans because this outfit I did want to wear the black jeans with. However, I think that it works out better with this like blue dark wash. So we've got this really pretty green mock neck ribbed sleeveless top. I think the fit is really nice. I'll probably tuck it in because we're gonna throw the little vest over it. Both are No Boundaries brand. The vest is in a size extra extra large. Remember that was the largest size that they had. But I, I hope it works because it could be really cute. Okay, how do we feel about this? Because I love, I do wish it was one size larger. I find it pulling just a little bit. I'm also trying to tuck in this top. Okay, love, this is so cute. And I think it's only appropriate that we do the Walmart booties that I mentioned that I own. Listen to me right now. This outfit is probably one of my most favorite outfits 
I put together, I was going to say this season, but we've only had a couple of fall like type clothing videos this season. So this is a favorite by far. I'm gonna say over the last couple of years of fall outfits, these boots, the jeans are from Timu by the way, I'll find them and link them down below for you. But this like little detail at the top, so pretty. And last item we have is this black dress. It's a thicker material, ribbed, I would say long sleeve, but it's more of like three quarter, if not a little bit longer with pockets. The length is really nice. On this one, it sits just above the knee. This could be really pretty belted. It could be really nice with a big chunky scarf and some tall boots. You could also wear sneakers with it if that's your thing, like casual type look. Yeah, I think this fit is really nice. I would probably just style this with these Walmart mules. I hauled them in my last Walmart video, but they're comfortable and they kind of dress up the look. I like it much better with the belt. It just adds a little bit more shape and personality to it. I'd stick with the same shoes. Okay, that is a wrap on this video. I hope you enjoyed it. It's still very much like a Taryn haul in this room. However, going in store and buying things I think is fun. Your store, unless you go to the exact store that I went to in my town, will most likely be different. I don't have a ton of plus size options in my store, which is why I sort of went off a little bit into the Juniors Plus section and pieces because I wanted to see if they would work for me and we talked about them as I was wearing them did they work did they not work I hope you enjoyed it I will link everything down below for you if you liked it please give it a thumbs up be sure to hit the subscribe button and I will see you in my next one bye y'all